Fearing death, Russian soldiers spend hours lying next to their dead comrades, pretending to be dead. Russian soldiers near Avdiivka spend hours lying next to the bodies of the dozens of their dead comrades in an effort to not join their newly deceased fellow invaders, Deputy Commander of Ukraine's 25th Storm Battalion, Ivan Smaga, told The Guardian. The NV media outlet reported this. There are dozens of bodies. They try to advance. We kill them. They send more, said Smaga. To begin with, it was groups of 10 men. Now it's only one or two or three without support. Their commander uses them like live meat, he said. Thrown into the fight, the enemy is using inventive methods to survive. Some crawled on the icy ground, others dug holes like mice, and some pretended to be dead, spending hours lying next to the bodies of fallen colleagues. We watch them, said Smaga. They lie under warm bodies. Eventually, they get up to move. Ukrainian drones and artillery shoot them down, Smaga added. Ukrainian defenders are holding on, Smaga said, adding that while the Russians could be idiots, they have more of everything. This encompasses a concentration of 40,000 soldiers at the Avdivka front, along with tanks, Soviet-era MT-LB armored combat vehicles and 152mm artillery guns. Since the end of summer, his unit has been receiving a reduced supply of ammunition, Smaga noted. We have enough ammunition to defend against attacks, but if they continue to advance, we will need much more. He said, Russians attempted to storm Avdiivka, launching several mechanized columns at the town but lost 80% of their equipment, Ukraine's Tavria Operational Command spokesperson Oleksandr Stupun said on November the 22nd. Russia had significantly increased the number of assault actions under Avdiivka, Stupun reported. The Russian invaders have lost about 10,000 soldiers during a month of active assaults on Avdiivka in the Donetsk region, Ukraine's commander-in-chief Valery Zaluzny reported.